Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday. It is 7 a.m. And that is why my voice is still raspy. That is why I'm still whispering because Ryan is still asleep. I'm about to get ready for a content day. Well, at least morning. Um, me and my friend Cicely are going to be shooting in the Mueller area this morning um, because I'm in Texas and it is getting so hot that I feel like it's so worth it just to like wake up and get like photos out of the way while it's like still like 75, like 80 because it's like getting up to like 95, 100 now. I'm gonna first start off with this chopstick. I have exciting news. I talked about it in the last vlog, but I was telling you guys that I got this um, sugar advanced therapy lip treatment um, as a gift from Sephora for like the birthday gift thing. And I've been using it for a while. It's been lasting me for a really long time. I really only apply it when I'm doing my makeup though. So I don't really like put it in my purse or anything. That's probably why it lasts so long. Um, but I did purchase it yesterday because I was thinking like, oh my God, it is actually like the best chapstick ever. And the only thing holding me back was the price because it's like $28 for a freaking chapstick. And it is, I think it's going to be bigger than this. I think this is like the mini size, but holy crap, this product is so good. And I wanted to talk about it on my vlog today because I kind of came to the realization, like I've been using it for so long. It makes my lips feel amazing. I'm also going to brunch today at a new place that I've been wanting to go to. It's so cute and like super like aesthetic. <laughs> and then I'm also shooting an event. I actually shot another event at the same house that I'm shooting today um, and the same people will be there. So I'm really excited to see them again because they're just all so nice and um, the house is really cool too. It has like a really awesome view of downtown. But if you guys are not already following my productions account where I like post all my photos and videos and stuff, um, I am a photographer and videographer if you guys didn't know. So go ahead and check out my profile. I'll have like a little pop-up thing here with my name. I'm finally tan enough to go back to my drugstore foundation, but this is running out. Like all of my foundations are on its last leg, so I finally have to like purchase foundation it's funny because we were at the domain yesterday and ryan was like do you even buy makeup anymore like do you like where do you even buy it like i never see you buying makeup i'm like honestly i feel like i don't unless it's like something i need like an eyebrow pencil or like foundation but i mean i can really get that at cvs because this is drugstore and my eyebrow pencil is drugstore too now i used to like be such like a brand snob and like want like Anastasia Beverly Hills and like NARS foundation although NARS is still really good but I don't know I feel like now I understand that there are like really good products out there that are drugstore got done doing my hair and I feel like it was just really curly like I don't know how and why but like when I cut my hair I feel like it's just so different curling it so I actually took my straightener and like went over a lot of the parts and it gave me these kind of like loose key waves this is like what I was going for um so I'm gonna do it to this side too you don't have to like put it on for too too long because you still want it to be like wavy. I don't know why I didn't think of this sooner. <laughs> I've never done this before, but I feel like it's such a good little hack in case you, you know, curl the curls too tight. I think that looks so much better, honestly, is what I was going for. I think I straightened it a little too much, so maybe I'll curl it, I don't know. But I think. I think it looks good. Cicely just texted me and said she was going to be a little bit late, which is honestly perfect because I just hate to rush. And I think I got up at like 6.30 this morning and it was so perfect because I just did not feel rushed. I could like chill and I like obviously um, pulled the outfits last night, 
but I did a little bit more like accessorizing this morning. So I grabbed some hats and I put some jewelry in this little bag that I have. It's from Kelly Wynn and I got it from a blogger party, but I thought it was perfect to put all like my jewelry in there so I could see it really quick. It feels pretty good outside. I just took Sophie out. So hopefully we don't sweat too much. I got everything packed up. This is literally everything I'm taking today. So let's see if we can do it all in one trip. I got the car all packed. I'm on my way to Mueller area. I think we're gonna meet at this place called Colleen's Kitchen. Hopefully the sun is like not too harsh on the building because like they have really nice like um, subway tile there. So we're just gonna check out the area, drive around and see what we can find. kitchen which is in the Mueller area it's so and cute over here yeah like I said this mm -hmm. place just has some really cute subway tile we got really lucky because the sun's not hitting this place very harsh and okay. yeah and it only opens at 11 so no one's here yeah no one's really here but <laughs> there is a farmer's market like close to this it's area probably starts, it's probably early it'll uh, be over by 11 really they usually, they usually start at like 7 maybe hopefully we'll, we'll hope so um <laughs> but we're gonna drive around and see what else we can find um, but yeah, this place just has really cool like like buildings, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. There's like, good backgrounds. For backgrounds, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, highly recommend if you're in the Austin area. All right, guys, we're on our second outfit and second location. Got my little 90s claw clip. There's so much construction going on here. So sorry about the noisy vlogs, but I'm trying to keep y'all updated. It's starting to get a little toasty, mm -hmm. but I bought this thing on Amazon. It is a pop-up tent and it is saving our lives right now. This is what it looks like. It's called the pop-up pod and it just has a zipper and bam, <laughs> perfect demo. <laughs> yeah, I'll link it down below in case you guys are like having content days, photo shoots outside. Cause usually like we change in our car and it's just like, even if you have the AC on, it's just so stressful. Cause like, you it's not like you can you're sitting down yeah you're sitting down it's not like you can like stand up so it's like way harder and this is so much faster so i'm very glad that i invested in that not that it was like crazy expensive anyways but we're gonna shoot our together look and yeah let's do it we are on our together outfit <laughs> we're just in like shorts boots and tees um and we're gonna try to take it on a tripod. We're in this little alley, so like no one really like sees us. And it's also shaded here, so we're gonna start and see what it looks like. Got my hat on and my last outfit. <clears throat> We're just doing some neutral backgrounds. I think I'm gonna go over there with the green over there. And yeah, we're almost done though. We had a successful shoe. I think it went really well and we just stopped when it was getting super hot. Um, but now I'm on my way to go to brunch with Taylor and Harley at Tiny Boxwoods. It's like this super cute um, brunch place. I think they're known for their milk and cookies. I know that they have a mural of it and people like take all their Instagrams there. I'm excited to get some food in my tummy because I've not eaten yet today. I'm at brunch with Harley and Taylor. Look how cute this freaking place is. I'm obsessed. This is like everything goals I've ever wanted in a brunch place. Um, and we got mimosas, so cheers, ladies. <laughs> and it was such a big brunch like I didn't even finish it all but it was so yummy and I ended up getting something at milk and cookies I got like a mint lemonade and it was delicious now I'm on my way to a shoot I'm shooting like a little girl's birthday party so I'll try my best to get some clips on there currently 
7.30 and we are off to take more pictures. My boyfriend is here this time and we're gonna take some rooftop parking deck pics or we're gonna try at least. This hat looks so weird on camera, but I swear it looks cool in pictures. <laughs> um, and it's also bent because it was in like a bag of the other hats because That's this morning. Is that one right? I, don't know. I just wanted to get like kind of my picture content day out of the way so I don't have to worry about it this week because I have a lot of work to do. Um, I am gonna travel for my job and then I also have like a lot of work to do for my videography projects. So before I go back home. It is a lot later. We actually just went grocery shopping because we wanted to get these cauliflower pizzas that we tried recently. They are actually so good. It's the California Pizza Kitchen cauliflower thin crust and it's gluten free. So it's really good, I recommend. Their pizza is like a chewy texture, which I like like for some reason. I don't know, I'm kind of weird. We also got a couple other things for this week. We're running out of toilet paper, so we got some and eggs. And if you guys are in Texas and have an HEB, they have like pre-made meals, but I couldn't find my favorite one. So I just got this salad, which I really like. It is the kale cranberry pepita salad and it's really good. Um, my mom used to get me this, these kale salads from Chick-fil-A and they're like so small and like not very cheap and it's literally like, it tastes the same and it's huge. So I got that for lunch for one day. Well, maybe like I'll split it up between lunches cause it's kind of a lot. And then, oh, my berries fell. Got a few berries um, for my oatmeal, but my H-E-B does not sell my very vanilla um, soy milk. And I like to put that in my oatmeal because I don't really add like any extra sugar. <clears throat> so recently I've just been like sweetening it with banana and that's pretty good. But anyways, I'm gonna get back to emptying my groceries. Ryan and I took pictures on top of a parking garage today and they turned out like okay. I'm most likely gonna post those pictures for Ryan's birthday on the 20th. It's literally this Saturday. Ryan, you're gonna be turning 23 on Saturday. He's actually younger than me. He is born in 1997 and I'm born in 1996. So he's like six months younger than me, I think. So there's like a period of time where he and I are the same age, which is weird. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, and I'm glad I vlogged this weekend. I just feel like I'm back in my groove and wanting to post as much content as possible. And hopefully like the vlogs at home are fun. Um, we're planning on going to the beach too. So I'm really excited about that. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram already, I'll leave a little pop-up thing right here. Um, my name is so underscore gnarly without the G on Instagram, so go check me out. And if you stayed through the whole vlog and you're not subscribed, then that means you like this vlog and you're gonna like a lot more. So go ahead and subscribe down below and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.